depending on where you are located in Africa here, your bidirectional pricing is key to your business model that you decide to adopt. In some countries, or in some parts of Ghana especially, the bidirectional is being done for low-income houses. So the low-income houses and the low-income areas are usually being sponsored by the government, which means that the government pays about 70% of the cost of the bidirectional installation and the homeowner only pays the 30%. If that's the model that you want to adapt for your services, then after learning the bidirectional construction, if you are in Ghana, you go to the assembly, you show them that you are an installer, you build your business, you show them your business registration, and you tell them you are a bidirectional installer, and then you want to be put on the assembly's work. Whenever there's an assembly work that's available, you will be called to go and do inspection and follow all the necessary procedure and then the contract is given to you. The government pays the 70% and then the homeowner pays the 30%. So those by digesters usually what happens is that the homeowner's money is what is given to you to use in your by digester installation. And then the assembly's money or the government money, which is usually disposed by the World Bank, comes at a later date. So it means that the by digester cost for that particular project will be lower. But then there's other ways whereby you can also do it for people who are building their houses, estate houses or self-contained houses who also need this biodigester because after comparing the cost of biodigester to septic tank or comparing septic tank cost to biodigester, most people will prefer to have a biodigester done if you are able to convince them. And then you are supposed to tell them how much it will cost them. Your cost can be done in comparison to how others have also priced the S1 after you've done your research and two, it can be costed based on how a septic tank in your locality or in the area you are living will also be. That's where you have to discuss the advantages that you bring to the table when you do a biodigester. Advantages like you are not going to dislodge again. Advantages like you do not need a big space to have a biodigester done. It means that you land that expensive land on your boat. You can use some parts to do another project instead of using it to do a septic tank. You can also talk about the how many days or hours that it might take you to install the biodigester for them. And then, of course, you can also talk about the quick turnaround time when it comes to the installation. So all these things will go into a price your digester. Each business model and how you plan it will be determined by the pricing that you do and how convincing you sound or how the kind of job that you have done, the experience that you have built over the years will all go to determine the price of a biodigester. So couple with your expertise, with your knowledge of the product and your experience over the months and years will help you determine how much you are able to charge for your biodigester construction. You can also determine this depending on where you are living, that's in which part of Africa you are living, moreover the materials that are available to you, and then all the other stops among others will go in a long way to determine how much you, you charge or how you cost your biodigester and the price you are able to put on it. Mm -hmm.